Welcome to a screencast of BleachBit version 0.5.3 from July 2009. BleachBit is a free and open source disk space and privacy cleaner. If you need to delete junk from your computer, try BleachBit. This video will give you a brief demonstration and instructions on how to use BleachBit. If you haven't already, hit the high quality button in your video player for higher quality. It is available in 20 languages. It runs on Windows XP, Vista, Windows 7, Ubuntu, Debian, Mandriva, Fedora, OpenSUSE, and other Linux distributions. It's a free and open source program. New versions have been coming out every two weeks or so. On the left side of the bleach bit interface is a list of cleaners. Under each cleaner is a list of options. When you click on the label of the cleaner, it gives you a description of what that cleaner does. You carefully read the descriptions so that you know what files are going to be removed. You should also use the preview button before making any changes. The preview button doesn't make any changes, but it shows you what files will be cleaned and the size that will be removed. When you've done that, when you've done the preview and reviewed your changes, click Delete. The confirmation dialog gives you one last chance to back out. Otherwise, click Delete. Which bit quickly went through and deleted all the files. It has a few preferences that you can adjust. In particular, this box here will shred files, securely delete them to prevent them from being undeleted. It doesn't work in all situations and it slows things down. Speaking of shredding, LeechBit can shred any file anywhere on your hard drive. For example, maybe you have a spreadsheet that you want to get rid of and make sure that no one else can find it. So you just click File, Shred File, and then point LeechBit to the file that you want to delete and then click Delete. For more information, to download BleachBit, just visit the BleachBit website, which is bleachbit-project.appspot.com. The video itself is open licensed under the Creative Commons, so feel free to use it and uh, translate it and share it. 